Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a cool car explosion effect easy in After Effects, let's begin. We will need two layers, one of the car and one of a clean background. Let's begin with isolating the car, grab a roto brush tool and double click on your clip. Now rotoscope the car as smooth as possible and once you are done selecting, click on freeze button. As the freezing is finished, close rotoscoping window. Now let's duplicate the layer and rename the top one to car only slash explosion. Select bottom layer and delete roto brush effect from it, then rename it to clean. I will toggle off car only layer for a while and then make sure clean layer is selected and then apply Mocha AE on it. In Mocha select a pen tool and mask the car something like that. Once you are done, enable perspective and click on tracking button. Once it's done, click on save here and then close Mocha. Now expand matte and click on create AE masks, then press M on a keyboard and change mask mode to subtract. Go to content aware fill now and click on create reference frame to open Photoshop. In a Photoshop, select the Remove tool and remove that transparent spot here. Once you are satisfied with the image, go to File and click on Save, then close Photoshop. Now under a content-aware fill, copy my settings and then click on Generate Fill Layer and wait until render and analyzing is done. Once it's done and the car is completely removed we can begin making an explosion effect. First make sure to drag car only layer above fill layer and then toggle it on. Now apply a shatter effect on it. Change view to rendered. Expand shape now and change pattern to glass. Change repetition to 30. The more you increase the repetition, the more glass shards you will have. I think 30 is enough. Once you are happy with it, expand physics and change gravity to zero. That will make the glass shards float in the air. If you want them to fall all the way down, increase the gravity. I think we are done with the shatter effect and now I will add an explosion VFX to make things look better. But first we will need to track the video, so make sure to solo clean layer for a while and then duplicate it. Select bottom one and rename it to tracker. Now delete the mask from it and don't forget to delete the mocha too. We can now unsolo clean layer and then make sure tracker layer is selected and then click on track camera and wait until it's done. Once it's done, select some points on the car, then right click on them and select create solid and camera. Now I will drag and drop an explosion VFX, check this video's description to download it for free. Enable 3D on explosion layer and then select track solid and press P on a keyboard. Copy that position and make sure to paste it onto the explosion layer. We can now unsolo all the layers and then make sure to completely toggle off track solid layer. Select explosion layer and scale it until it looks fine to you. Also make sure to move it below car only layer and then reposition the explosion until it looks better. Let's quickly check it. And we are done. To make things smoother and better, I will add a shake effect. I will use one from my shakes pack. I will skip shakes part because I have made too much shake tutorials. Also I have made 16 unique shake presets that you can get from the link in description. Check how it looks like with my shake presets. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.